<sighs> right, hello my loves. Right, it's me again. Um, I very nearly uninstalled the game earlier. <laughs> I was so angry with it. Um, but I've decided to persevere just because I want to finish the series. Uh, but what I'm going to do is I've already cheated already to spare you the agony of me trying to work it out. So, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and do this. Acre. So we've got to do this in a set order. So we start at Acre. Acre. No idea why. Then we go to London. I think that's London. London. Yep. London. Mm-hmm. Then to Paris. 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 And then, I think, Cyprus. Cyprus. Yep. Okay, then we go to Cyprus. Cyprus. Okay, apparently that's it. Now we can pick it up. I've got it. Thank God for that. Strange. It's so much lighter than it looks. Oh, George, it's beautiful. I know. Amazing. Now all we got to do is work out how we get out of here. Now that bit I haven't cheated on yet, so we're going to have to work that out. It's something to do with the plinth. Okay, this evening I'm drinking some Bishop's Finger. There's church bells in the background as well. And I've also got a glass of red wine. <laughs> Why not? It's a heady mix. Okay. Let's see if we can work this little bugger out. So let's have a look at it. It's the plinth for the cherub. It stands dead center in the room on what must be Jerusalem. Mm-hmm. Okay, so we've got a little arrow there. It looks like an arrow. So... God knows. Oh, my Christ. Down, left, right. Okay, let's point it towards where we picked up the... No, that's the wrong way. No, I'll tell you what, let's just dick around with it. <laughs> that sound is it being reset, I think. So... What a stupid fucking puzzles these are. They're just stupid, aren't they? And that reset it. Right. I'm not fucking around again. Right. Cheating time. Okay. Right. Um, so we'll put it where it was. Okay. So let's press down just to reset it. Okay, so this is what the person did. One, two, three, down, left, down. Left. Down. Why? It worked. Let's get out of here. Why? How? So fucking annoying. We did it, George. Miracle. I know. Are we brilliant or what? It's a miracle. Champagne's on me. No way, that's my treat. Okay, I'll buy you dinner. Deal. He just touched her ass then. <laughs> ah, well, there we are. Crikey, we're making mega progress today. <laughs> oh, what a meal. What an evening. Oh my god, what's going to yep. happen now? Well, time for bed, I think. Time for sofa. <laughs> 
Uh, better hit the sack. George, wouldn't you be more comfortable here? Comfortable? Good lord. Uh -huh. Does that mean what I think it means? Want to show me what you think it means? Oh my god. How long you got? All night. That enough? It'll do. For starters. One thing. Yeah? Who's Nico? <laughs> Last night, you talked about her in your sleep. Oh, she's somebody I knew. Once. <laughs> past life. A different country. Yeah, something like that. One more thing. Last one. Turn the angel round, would you? <laughs> God. <laughs> well, I'll be darned. This is the first Broken Sword game where George has um, been a bit naughty. Well, I'll be darned. My grandfather used to say to me, George, life is full of ups and downs. And with a face like yours, you'd better get used to the downs. Very funny. But in the end, not far from the truth. So how did it all go wrong this time? Let's go back to the Pasha Palace. Pasha? Oh, hell. Don't tell me he didn't, um, they didn't, uh, uh shag. Anna Maria and I had, hmm. well, uh, we were, I was, uh, asleep when I heard a noise. I didn't see who did it or what they did with Anna Maria. But when I came around, she was gone. And in her place was the waiter, <laughs> which was strange. Kind of reassuring. I hadn't ordered room service, but that wasn't why he was there. He wanted answers, and I believed him when he said he'd shoot me through each kneecap if he didn't get them. <laughs> I think it's right. safe to say he had his own agenda. And somehow he knew about the cherub. I seem to remember saying, Anna Maria's been kidnapped. But the waiter was more interested in the cherub. How big was it? Was it really gold? Who was I working for? Then, suddenly, sirens. Terrific, I thought. I'm going to be rescued from this lunatic. It was the cavalry, all right. And they sure were coming to arrest somebody. Me. My face had been recognized on security footage at Top Cop. <laughs> they thought I was a terrorist. And the waiter? Yeah. He was no waiter. He was some kind of cop. Name of Mevlet. Yeah. Things were just getting peachier and peachier. Mevlet told him to seal the room, then he left. A soldier with an interesting face came really close and said, Want a kiss? George, you have been a very bad boy. <laughs> you are going to prison for a long, long time. <laughs> <laughs> I thanked him. Like a good American citizen, and then it all went black. Wow, it's all happening. And here I am. Not your average vacation cruise, huh? It must be said that <clears throat> I love point and click adventures that start in dungeon. Lure of the, Temp Lure of the Temptress, Curse of Enchantia, I'm sure there's others. But we, yeah, this is definitely a reference to that. Okay, we've got a. It's gone. There was one of those in the um, the Temptress, if I remember rightly. A window right out of reach, taunting me. Similar window as well. Out of reach. Have we got all our stuff? No, they've taken everything. Inviting? No. Comfortable? No. Adequate? Not even. <laughs> um. Okay. It's the same, is it? No thanks, I'd rather fret. Okay. Uh, got a grill there. A complex drain system runs across the floor. Perfect for getting rid of all that blood, sweat and tears. Right, I promise I'm not going to cheat on this bit. So, it's because it's such a contained space, just one room, we should be okay. Very damp wall. The mortar's crumbling. Well, that was a bloody piece of paper or something. Very damp wall. The mortar's crumbling. Okay. 
helle. On the table a piece of moldy cheese which is just beginning to evolve. <laughs> yeah, we'll have a bit of that. Aha. Uh -huh. I know how this works. Now, if only I had a bit of string and a magnet, I could get the key in no time. <laughs> On second thought, I don't really want to touch that cheese. If the rat doesn't want it, neither do I. Oh my god, he's not picking the bloody cheese up. Can you believe it? Doesn't look like the rat's coming out. Ow! Darn rat! <laughs> No more rats, but there's something else there. Bracket. Oh yeah. A small metal bracket. Right, we can use that to bludgeon the rat to death. Oh, he's gone. I mean, can, I think we use it for on the uh, mortar there. Probably let's try that. That's not the right approach. It would help if you did the right thing, old boy. Yeah, there. The mortar's loose around the stone. I just have to scrape it away. There. Now I'll be able to pull the stone out of the wall. Do so. Bloody Here hell. comes the block. He's strong when he wants to be. Hey, American! That no good! You just lose me 20 lire. Not that it do you any good. You'll just make it <laughs> to the next cell. <laughs> now give me that blood. You might cut yourself. Oh, Stab him with it. And uh, someone's here to see you. What the hell? I am Father Nicolas. This is Sister Immaculata. My son, you have suffered more than you deserve. I couldn't agree more. But remember... There are always others worse off than yourself. Oh, yeah? Well, I don't see them lining up to join me in here. News of your um, arrest reached our orphanage. The children understand that even the Do most they? damned of sinners may yet repent in the face of love and charity. Really? Nice of them to put it like that. They have donated these playthings to occupy your time until the execution. The nun? The what? <laughs> I mean, uh, <laughs> oh. From Jenna, these marbles. From Khalil, this little mechanical mouse. <laughs> From Erol, this squeaky toy. <laughs> and now we must leave. There is a last client on death row in need of prayer. Yeah? Well, give him my best, huh? And uh, thanks for the toys. Just what I always wanted. On the roof, one hour. Be there. What? Hey! What did you say? Execution? Just what I need. <laughs> we need to get the hell out of here. Okay. Fucking guard out there. Damn. Okay. Okay. Guard. What do you want? Was it something I said? Oh. <clears throat> now he's warming to me. I can tell. Hmm. The door to the cell. Okay, so the only thing we can do in this cell is call for the guard. Anyway, let's see what we got here. Mechanical mouse. A little mechanical mouse that you wind up. Let's give it a go. Okay. The key from the mouse. 
the mouse is wound up and ready to go. My goodness. Okay, got marbles. A handful of marbles. Hmm, that takes me back. Hmm. This string doesn't look like it belongs on a marble bag. It's strong nylon cord. The marble bag unfolds. Oh my god. A rubber thing that talks when you squeeze it. Play with me. Play with me. Oh my god. I thought this might be easy, but it's not. Oh god. Guard? So right, it's gonna be something to do with calling the guard. What do you want? Wanna play a game of dice? <laughs> hmm. What's the purpose of that then? <clears throat> right, let's see if we can combine some of this stuff. Uh Using that won't work. Okay. Could use. Mm, that won't work here. Could use the mouse key on the lock, perhaps. Mm, that won't work here. Oh boy. Mm, that won't work here. Um. Mm, that won't work here. Hmm. Using that won't work. Right, he doesn't want to pick it up, but maybe if we wrap it in the cloth. Hmm, not this time. <clears throat> Stick the key in it. Hmm. Can't access that now. That's not such a good idea. Hmm. The mouse can get through, but George can't. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm, that won't work here. String. Using that won't work. Bugger some marbles down. Well, I'll be darned. The marbles spread nicely in front of the door. Right. Okay. Call for the guard. He falls on the marbles. Dead. <laughs> okay, might be able to get his keys now. The guard's out cold, but not for long. Oh shit. I fucking hope this isn't timed one. Um Just reach the key. Sweet. Right, drag him in. <laughs> I only want to steal the key. Oh. Okay, good. Right, which way do we go? My mind's telling me this way. But my body, my body is telling me this isn't the right way. Nope. Come on, George, quick, before he runs off. Kick him. 
Lovely. Oh. I've got to do something about that guard. He's gonna wake up any minute. Oh shit. Time up. With his hands and feet tied together, he's going nowhere. Nailing it. Mm-hmm. Now stick the key up his bottom. No, I think that's about it. Good. Okay, All right, let's see what's over here. I could have sworn I saw my things <clears> on this table. <throat> oh, rats. An empty table. Nothing else there. We need our things. Oh I fuck! Have that guard and tied his hands. Oh, what are you joking me? Okay, fine. Gag. Okay. A nice gag. That'll stop him yelling. Okay. All right. Stupid. Ah, it's a bloody pooch. Aha! The mouse key will open the tin of meat. A can of beef on the table. I can't pick it up with the dog staring at me. In that case, yes. Uh, maybe you'll like that. Quick, while it's busy. <laughs> Got it. Okay. Right, use this. I'll just have a look at it first. A can of corned beef. <coughs> the opening key seems to be missing. Hmm, what can we do? The mouse key is perfect for opening the can. Okay. Put that in his bowl. Here, boy. Dinner. Sweet. Let's have a little look around. She said it could go on the roof, didn't she? The hot nun. Which could be Nico. Can you imagine that? We're not going to be able to go out there, I don't think. Let's go up here. Oh, I'm back here. Ah, mm hmm. Oh, my God. Um, so, what do we do? Do we just escape or go back the way we came last time? It's probably empty. Mm hmm. So, is this turned off now? It says warning. This museum uses an infrared alarm system. Do not enter when activated. This would be the quickest way out. Locked, and I can't squeeze under. No, <laughs> not surprised. You'd have to be about one centimeter tall to squeeze under that. Perhaps a slug. Uh, let's use computer. Someone's taken the trouble of installing an extra firewall on this PC. I can't get in now. Well, you ain't got your um, doodad anyway. Oh, Christ. Um. Mm, best not to go back there. The dog's probably finished his dinner. Hmm. George, for Christ's sake. What is he? Yeah. If we've got to go all the way back again, I'm going to puke. The guards are patrolling the yard. <coughs> Vigilant is <coughs> a... The guard with the dog will be back. Probably shouldn't risk it. So where the devil do we go? Oh, she did say the roof. Hmm. do we do? Ah. A 
big vines growing all the way up to the roof. Could that be my way up? Looks sturdy enough to climb. Yeah, go on then. There's no way I can climb up there while the guards are patrolling the yard. Right, so we got to let the mechanical... Ah, right, okay. That's why he made the comment about not being able to squeeze under the door. We can't get through there, but the mechanical mouse can. Well, that's what I'm assuming, anyway. Right. Yeah, sweet. Off you go, little mousy. Sometime soon he's going to set off the alarm. I don't want to be around when that happens. Mm -hmm. See, so those kind of puzzles, that's fine. That That's logic, and it more or less makes sense, but... Oh, for Christ's sake, mate. Up here. <sighs> mm hmm. Nice way of reusing assets as well. This level. <laughs> I can climb up the vine while the guards are distracted by the. Mm -hmm. Yep, yeah, got that. Oh, and he just vaporized. Right, on the roof. Now, where is that priest? Where's a priest when you need one? Uh, right, gotta be careful here. Yeah? We haven't got our stuff back. What the? <laughs> oh, for Christ's sake, I just looked at him. Clues. <sighs> Hello. A loose stone lying on the roof. A loose stone lying on the roof. And? A loose stone lying on the roof. Speak to me, little toy. <laughs> Perfect. What? Oh shit, which way is Who's he going? That? Play with me. Play with me. What the? Play with me. Oh, there she is. Um, thanks for the toys, sister, but what do we do now? Pray for a miracle? No, Georges. You remain patient and ask politely. Nico! Mind my wimple, Georges. What would Father Nicholas say? But what are you doing here? Saving you from a heroic death, I think. Well, I appreciate it, but how did you get here, and, and what's with the outfit? Oh, Georges, when you didn't call for so long, I began to despair. And then, I decided to renounce the world. <laughs> oh my god, you mean, you really are... a nun? Hey, Georges, get real, I'm just kidding. Yeah, I, I knew that. That's not so, Nikkei's voice. fancy a swim. With you? Anytime, but how? I've got a zip wire all rigged up, ready and waiting. Well, what's keeping us? Just like old times, huh? Let's go. By the way, I shagged a random yeah. bird I met the other day. <sighs> the hell? Yeehaw! God damn it. So, that's how I ended up in jail. Well, you have been busy, Georges. And this girl, what's her name? Mandy? Angela? Anna Maria. It never occurred to you that she's been playing you for a sucker? What? Nico! She's run you like dumb and dumber, don't you see? No, I don't. She's a victim in all this, just like me. And she's wonderful and <laughs> fantastic and the best thing that's ever happened to me. And if you don't want to help me, then you can... Okay, okay. Just needed to know how sure you were about this whole thing. 
Well, I am sure, damn sure. Good. So now that's clear, George. What shall we do? Okay. What a shag. <laughs> we need to get back into my room somehow. Hmm. Look for clues. Your cover's blown. So that's going to be up to me. I'll see if I can get us access to the rooms. Funny there's no cops here. I smell a trap. You're going to be okay? George, I'm a little out of practice. But with an outfit like this, how difficult can it be, huh? Good luck. Hmm. I'll hang back, keep my head down. Yeah, you do that, George. I'm getting fed up with you. Never thought I'd say that. Oh, it's George. I can't hate George. Crikey, she can move? Uh, right. Let's talk to this receptionist. Can I help you? You wouldn't appreciate this. <clears throat> But we always have the most fantastic celebrities staying here. Oh, yes. That old lady, the crime writer, didn't she... Duh, get real. I'm talking pop stars, sportsmen, media giants, not fat old writers. <laughs> and do you have any celebrities staying here now? Oh, yes. We have Eamon Omara. The Eamon Omara. Of course, he and I, we're like that now. Oh, like that? What a thought. Hmm. Actually, what I really need is Eamon's room key. Oh, do you now? I can't really tell you why, but I'm a nun. You can trust me. <laughs> ha! If I gave you the key, you'd have to deal with Eamon himself. And I can tell you, last time I saw him, he was in a terrible mood. Actually, last time I saw him, he was in more than a terrible mood. What do you mean? He was dead. What? Gone. Passed away. But how? Took his own life. The <laughs> poor, poor boy. But he and I were talking only an hour ago. <laughs> yes, it was very sudden. His heart was broken. Oh, God. By the way, he asked me to give you this photo of himself. So at the end, he was thinking of me? Oh, yes. He said, remember me to... to the receptionist. <laughs> he said that? Well, more or less, I don't recall exactly. So all those things he said to me, those words, he meant everyone? Oh, he did, <laughs> he did. He really loved me. Yes, with all his heart. Oh, can I have the key? Of course. <sighs> Aha, right, we've got all of... <laughs> George's stuff. Uh, so Nico must have taken it as she was walking past. Luckily, we've got the sausage. Right, so maybe we can take the lift. Look how fast she is. Go upstairs? Um, got me thinking, no? No, I'm going to stay. <laughs> Let's have a little chat with uh, Georgie first. <clears throat> I'm really worried about her, Nico. <laughs> I'm fine, thanks. Though that bump on my head still hurts. Anyway, right, let's go. Should I go upstairs? Yeah, go on. No surprise they were guarding my room. <laughs> if they'd spotted me, I'd have been toast. Maybe there's a back way to get in. Through the window. Yeah. Wait here, Nico. I'll see if I can climb down to the third floor. All right. Call me if you need anything. Oh, hell. I got our stuff back. Okay. So, can we go in there? This place is classy. Nice shower. Hmm. George, my boy, you are one lucky guy. Hmm. Should have stayed with Nico. Not keen on that Anna Marie. Whatever she's called. Anna Marie? I don't know. Okay, look at that. The camera angles are shocking. Can't even see the toilet. I always like having a nice toilet to look around. Uh, right. Thing here. Being extra vigilant here. The camera angles are absolutely shite. 
back, there's a window, there's an open window, that's where we're going. There you go. Jump. <laughs> so, Anna Maria and I hmm. were in room 304. Anna Maria. A corner room. There must be that one there. <sighs> okay. And climb down there. Ah, right, okay. So... Can't go any further that way, so we must have to carry on across here. No. Okay, I just saw where we need to go. Down here, there's a ledge. Here? Yeah, there. Drop. No. Hmm. Making brilliant progress here. Uh, down here? No. Okay, it's only letting us climb here. Right, we had to press the right mouse button. Um, climb over there. Drop. Oh, this is a piece of piss. Someone watching. Right, so we can't go that way. But we're not going to be able to climb back up, are we? Shit. Hmm. Ah, yes, of course. Can't see us now, you devil. <laughs> Could have done it. It's a bit slow doing it this way, but there we are. Sweet. Okay, up we come. Right, that's our room in there. Lovely. My God, we're rocketing through this game now. George. God damn it. Okay, well, what do we do here then? So this is where Anna Maria was kidnapped. Uh, let me get out of the door. We don't need to do that. Uh, uh, hello there. Didn't see that. <clears throat> hmm. A rosary? Could it be Anna Maria's? Hmm. I better take that. Okay. Let's have a little pill look at it. Anna Maria's Rosary. On the back of the cross, it says Memento Mori. Mm hmm. A waste basket. Maybe Anna Maria left something in it. A tampon, What's if this? you're lucky. A credit card receipt. <sighs> Anything to report, officer? No, sir. Oh. Nothing. Uh-oh. Hmm. All right. I'll take over now. But, sir, I've got my orders. And I'm giving you new ones. Go. <laughs> ah. Mr. Stobart. <coughs> no, no. Don't be alarmed. Father Nicholas? Your favorite priest, hmm. no less. And cop, too? Or is this another disguise? Cop? No. Somewhere within the panoply of Turkish military intelligence? Yes. Oh, mm -hmm. so you're a spook. You want to tell me what's going on? It is quite simple. 
When you flew into Istanbul, you triggered an alert. A mafia connection. Ah. Hmm. Then at Topkapi, you became a terrorist. <laughs> uh -huh. And finally, I realized you were just a treasure hunter. You figured right. A romantic profession. It appeals to my sense of drama. Glad you enjoyed the show. So, anyhow, now you are free. Go, please. Uh, there will be no guards downstairs, <coughs> no problem at the airport. But what about Anna Maria? She's been kidnapped. <coughs> so dramatic, Mr. Stobart. Kidnapped? <laughs> Run off, more like. Or maybe found a new boyfriend. How dare you? Who knows? You have found another pretty girl. So, forget that. No, it's not like that at all. Go now, Mr. Stobart. I cannot guarantee you free passage for long. Hmm. Luckily, she has telepathy. You made it. Mevla, or rather Father Nicholas, helped me out. Really? I'll tell you about it later. I found a credit card bill. I might be able to trace Anna Maria's address from this. Uh, okay. Phew. Let's talk to this bloody woman again. Can I help you? Yes, I do come here often. <clears throat> Outstanding. Um, there won't be anything here. No. You never know. The waiter hasn't cleared that table yet. <sighs> that was a red herring, if ever there were one. Can okay, look out there. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Leaving now doesn't really make sense. Doesn't it? I mean, Christ, what else is that to do? It's a credit card received ah. <laughs> from Leonardo da Vinci Airport signed by Anna Maria. Okay. Um. I've got room 505, not the one I wanted. Anna Maria's room is two floors below. Yeah, we've done that, George. Hmm. Yes, maybe I can hack the um, hotel computer. Credit or us? Oh no. Oh my god, this looks intense. Oh no. Ah, I reckon this is elementary. There's one there. <laughs> uh, easy tiger. Yeah, that's fine. I say this is going to be easy. Shit. 
Um, let's take those out of the way. No, that's no good. That's going to have to go down there. So let's put it there. I'm using up too many doodads here. No good. Ah. Anna Maria lives in Rome. Okay. Well, she never mentioned that. Nico, I've got it. It's a Rome address. 128 Vicolo Service Marite. Wow, the expensive part of town. So Is let's it? go see if she's home. Well, I'll be darned. We've done pretty well today. We only cheated right at the very beginning when it was just absurd to bother wasting time trying to work it out. Here we are. Vicolo Service Marite. How about that, George? You've fallen for a girl who lives in the very heart of the most romantic city in the world. Uh huh. Shame she never told you. Y there's a cruel streak in you, Nico, that I never saw before. That's nice. That's the first time that I've thought that the graphics actually look nice. That was quite nice. Okay, I think this would be a nice place to end it, to be honest. So we're in Rome, and we're back with Nico. How wonderful. Um, I preferred her in the uh, nun's uh, wimple, to be honest. But there we are. Beggars can't be choosers. Right. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed that one. I enjoyed that better than the last one. Anyway, see you next time. And uh, yeah, cheerio for now.